Iris Fontbona is a Chilean businesswoman and one of the richest women in the world, according to various Forbes rankings over the years. Iris Fontbona was born in 1942 in Santiago, Chile. Much of her wealth originates from her inheritance from her late husband, Andronico Luxic Abaroa, who passed away in 2005. Andronico Luxic Abaroa was one of Chile's most successful businessmen and had built a massive conglomerate spanning industries such as mining, banking, and beverages. Font Bona and her family own Antofagasta PLC, a copper mining company with significant interests in Chile. This is one of the primary sources of her wealth. The family also has a stake in Quinenco, a consumer packaging and beverage company. Beyond these, the Luxic family group has diversified interests including banking, with Banco de Chile being a notable asset. The Luxic family is known for its philanthropic efforts in Chile, supporting various causes related to education, culture, and health. Iris Fontbona's children, Guillermo Luxic Craig, Jean Paul Luxic Fontbona, and Andronico Luxic Craig, are actively involved in the management and expansion of the family's business empire. The family, as a whole, is among the most influential in Chile. Over the years, Iris Fontbona has consistently ranked among the top richest women in the world and has been a fixture on Forbes' list of billionaires. Fontbona tends to keep a low profile and avoids the limelight, which is somewhat unusual for individuals of her wealth and influence. Antofagasta PLC is a Chilean-based company involved primarily in the mining industry. It's one of the more prominent copper producers in the world. Founded back in the 19th century, by the late 20th and early 21st centuries, Antofagasta's mining interests had become its core focus. The company is controlled by the Luxic family, one of Chile's wealthiest families. Iris Fontbona, the widow of the family patriarch Andronico Luxic Abaroa, is a major shareholder. The principal commodity of Antofagasta is copper, and its mining activities are concentrated in Chile. The company operates several mines in Chile, with some of the most notable being Los Pelombers, Centinela, and Tucoya, Zaldivar. While copper is the company's main product, Antofagasta also produces molybdenum, gold, and other byproducts. Apart from its mining activities in Chile, Antofagasta PLC has exploration and evaluation or feasibility activities in North America, Europe, Africa, and across the rest of South America. Antofagasta PLC is listed on the London Stock Exchange and is a member of the FTSE 100 Index, making it one of the UK's top 100 publicly traded companies by market capitalization. Like many modern mining companies, Antofagasta PLC often emphasizes its commitment to environmental, social, and governance ESG, criteria. The mining industry faces significant scrutiny due to its potential environmental impacts, and companies like Antofagasta work to implement sustainable practices and community engagement initiatives. Antofagasta PLC plays a significant role in the Chilean economy. The mining sector is a major contributor to Chile's GDP and export revenues, and companies like Antofagasta are central players in this industry. The Luxic family, under the leadership of Iris Fontbona and her children after the passing of her husband Andronico Luxic Abaroa, has demonstrated a commitment to long-term growth and investment, especially in core sectors like mining and banking. The group's varied interests in mining, beverages, banking, and other sectors show an appreciation for diversifying assets and investments to mitigate risks and tap into various revenue streams. There's a strong sense of preserving and building upon the family legacy. The involvement of her children in the businesses underscores the family's approach to ensuring continuity and instilling the next generation with the values and vision of the founders. The Luxic family and its businesses have engaged in various philanthropic activities in Chile. This reflects a belief in giving back to the community and taking on responsibilities beyond just business operations. Iris Fontbona's low public profile might suggest a management style that values discretion, focusing on business operations rather than personal publicity. While the businesses have international operations, there's a clear commitment to Chile's development, both in terms of business investments and philanthropic activities.